So the time has finally come and Lucasfilm have just dropped our first ever look at Grand Admiral Thrawn in the Ahsoka series, along with many other characters like Ezra Bridger, Sabine Wren, Hera Syndulla and much much more. So hit that subscribe button and let's get into it. So the trailer begins with showing us many of the characters that we already know will appear from Star Wars Rebels, like Ezra, Sabine, Hera and Chopper, but also introduces us to two new dark side characters and brings back Morgan Elspeth, the Night Sister from Mando Season 2. I had a theory video all the way back two years ago predicting that she was a night sister, so it's nice to see her back. After this though, we hear Ahsoka say that she's been hearing rumours that Grand Admiral Thrawn is back from deep space and is acting as the heir to the Empire. This is a reference to two things. The first is Thrawn and Ezra's expulsion into the unknown regions by the Purgle at the end of Star Wars Rebels. In order to save the planet Lothal and cast Thrawn out of the galaxy, Ezra Bridger communed with Purgle through the Force to get them to rip Thrawn's fleet into hyperspace in an unknown direction, leaving the two stranded to this day. Now, the Heir to the Empire mention is a reference to the first ever officially canon novel in the Star Wars Legends continuity called Heir to the Empire, which detailed the time after Return of the Jedi and Thrawn's journey to restore the Empire. This line could mean we're getting a near adaptation of that book trilogy, just with the new canon characters. Now, after that, we see the back of Grand Admiral Thrawn himself in live action for the first time ever. Still careful to never show his face. The man who will serve as the main villain of the entire series and probably the Mandoverse itself. Thanks so much for watching and and I'll keep you updated with all of the news coming out of Celebration just like this.